Okay, so today um, we are going to talk about what you first want to do when you have established your WordPress blog. The very first thing you're going to want to do if you've never had WordPress is go in and change your user information. And in order to do that, you're going to go to your dashboard, and your dashboard looks like this. It has your menu items along the side of it, and it has your main area in front of you. You're going to want to scroll down, slide down to the area that has users. This is right here. And on the drop down, you want to go to your profile. That's the first thing you want to change. Don't worry about anybody else's. And we um, have all of these options as far as what you want your dashboard to look like. You can change the color of your dashboard if you would like. You can add keyboard shortcuts. Um, you can decide to show your toolbar or not. And this is where I want us to start to pay attention. Here is where you can put in some information that will show up on your site and is useful. You're going to want to put in your first name. You're going to want to put in some of your information like your nickname. Uh, you probably don't want to be known as admin. You probably want to be known as um, I am awesome. You're going to want to put in your, your email here. And then as you go through here, you're going to want to put in your Twitter information, your Facebook information. You can put in biographical information. This would be your, your profile about me. This is the area that will show up on a Google search if um, you have elected to do it that way, you will have this show up on your Google search. Uh, WordPress SEO site settings, this is if you have multiple authors, you're going to want to do something with this, um, insert your title for your author page, but for right now you can kind of ignore this if you're brand new on WordPress, just kind of ignore all of the rest of this and focus m mainly on this area here. I want you to um, get that filled out. This Google Plus area, you want to go in and get your profile, your URL for your profile for Google+, Plus. put this in, and because of the HTML5 information, um, you will be authenticated as an author of your site. So there you go. So right now you are going to be known as I am awesome because I got that fixed for you. So that is how you change your information 